subscribe our channel press the bell icon for latest videos hi friends here in this video i am going to explain the block diagram for a vcrs cycle that would give us just a rough idea of a vapor compression refrigeration system so let's get started So this is the full form of VCRS that is it is vapor compression refrigeration system here I'll quickly draw the block diagram for the same. Now, here basically in VCRS there are four components compressor, condenser, throttle or we can say throttle valve or expansion valve both are same and then there is evaporator. Now what happens at first the liquid refrigerant will enter from the throttle into the evaporator. So here there is liquid refrigerant which enters the evaporator inside the evaporator this liquid refrigerant will go on absorbing the heat and then it will vaporize so at the exit of the evaporator we are getting the vapor refrigerant then this vapor refrigerant gets compressed inside the compressor where its pressure and temperature is raised so when the refrigerant is coming into the evaporator it is having low pressure low temperature then when it comes out of the compressor after compression process Again we have vapor, a refrigerant, but here it is at high pressure and high temperature. Then this high vapor, high, high pressure, high temperature vapor which enters the condenser is at a saturated condition where in the condenser it condenses into liquid refrigerant which is again it gets converted into a liquid refrigerant which would be again at high pressure and high temperature because inside the condenser the temperature remains same it is latent we can say condensation so high pressure high temperature this is at the entry to the throttle or expansion valve once the throttling goes on then the pressure drops even the temperature drops and the liquid refrigerant further goes into the evaporator go on goes on absorbing the heat so in short that was just a block diagram explanation for a vcrs cycle in the further videos, we are going to see the detailed description taking the components as a whole. And here we have to remember that the compressor is the heart of this VCRS cycle. Without compressor, it cannot work. Then at the end, if you'll find my videos helpful, you'll can like, share, comment and subscribe our channel and share it amongst your family and friends. Thanks for watching.